This is Channel 2 Action News This Morning. Coverage you can count on. Hey, good morning to you. It's 8.56. I'm Warren Savage. I'm Pam Martin. We'll have weather and traffic in just a moment. First in the news, Atlanta Mayor Shirley Franklin beginning her day with a bunch of angry workers who have been laid off. 280 city workers are getting pink slips this week because of budget cuts. Their last day on the job will be just two days before Christmas. Mayor Franklin expected to talk to some of those upset about the layoffs in just a few minutes at 9 a.m. And the latest move in a power line controversy in Cobb County comes from a state representative. Judy Manning is filing a bill to limit the power of companies such as the Georgia Transmission Corporation to put in power lines where they see fit. For more than a year now, some citizens have been fighting a project to put up a power line along Dallas Highway. As we check the drive to work, we find a little bit of improvement. Here's Mark Aram. Yeah, tale of two rush hours out of Cobb County, though, Pam. 75 southbound is a parking lot from Wade Green Road down to earlier trouble at the North Loop. But south of that, wide open all the way from Marietta to the city of Atlanta. Captain Herb Emery, 400. Still riding into a bumper-to-bumper -bumper zone on Georgia 400 southbound as you approach the North Point Mall. There's north and southbound delays. But if you're headed south, you're going to stay on the brake pedal on and off in spots all the way until you clear the Chattahoochee River. Earlier trouble there should be cleared. Double trouble on the East Freeway. Crashes clearing 20 west at Turner Hill and Panola Road. I'm Mark Aram. Triple Team Traffic, Channel 2 Action News this morning. Thank you, Mark. You may experience a drier ride home this afternoon. Here's Karen. Yes, right now the rain is tapering off, but we do have some fog, so visibility is quite low in many areas. And the temperature should reach 58 degrees today with partly cloudy skies on your Friday and colder, even colder still by Saturday morning with temperatures in the 20s. Thank you, Karen. That's local news, weather, and traffic till now. Thank you for counting on Channel 2 Action News. For more on the stories you just saw, log on to our website, WSBTV.com. For more coverage you can count on, please join us for Channel 2 Action News at noon. Now stay tuned for Live with Regis and Kelly. Have a great morning. There are several places to get the world's best coffee. Now your home is one of them. The Cuisinart Automatic Grind and Brew makes coffee that tastes like it comes from your favorite coffee bar. It starts with the push of a button. The Automatic Grind and Brew grinds whole beans, releasing all the flavor. Then it brews a wonderfully fresh pot of coffee. So why go out for great tasting coffee? Let the Cuisinart Automatic Grind and Brew bring all the enjoyment home. Available at fine stores everywhere. Sometimes it seems like the world moves in slow motion, especially when you're in a hurry. But there's one place you can go where you know you'll be moving fast. McDonald's. Introducing McDonald's Gone in 30 Seconds Guarantee. You'll get your food within 30 seconds after you pull up to the pickup window. Or on your next visit, we'll give you the sandwich of your choice absolutely free. So stop by McDonald's today, even if it is only for a few seconds. The Delta International Series at the Fox Theater presents Live on stage, the Georgian State Dance Company. Get your tickets now. Don't miss ABC's coverage of Monday Night Football, brought to you by Chevrolet. Stay tuned for Montel next, right after Regis and Kelly. It's live with Regis and Kelly. Today, 